Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Yep, it's me, OBG. I made a video, I know it's been a long time, but let's talk about why it is that I've been gone for a bit, why did I take my time coming back, and where are we with this new setup and this new everything that I got going on behind me? Let's talk about it. Also, before I forget, as this video gets started, don't forget to hang out through the whole video. Throughout the video, I'm going to be saying something and then I'm going to have a question at the end of the video. If you can answer it correctly, post it in the comments below, like the video, make sure you subscribe. It'll get you entered into a giveaway where we're giving away a TIE Fighter set and a Clone Trooper Battle Pack. Both those sets are going to be available for free to one lucky subscriber. So make sure you comment on this video. You let me know what that answer is and we will make sure that you get entered into that contest that we will be revealing live on stream. So this is the first video back after a month. Yes, it's been that long. But hey, it's something that I needed to do only because I needed to refresh my mind. As I get older, I need those more often than I used to. And that's not always a bad thing. That is something that it allows me to gain motivation, gain more focus, and put in a bigger effort in getting videos and getting some stuff done. In the process of that little hiatus, I was able to get a bunch of ideas on what it is that I want to do on the channel, what I'm going to be working on and things like that. My wife is always going to be that person that's going to always be pushing me because as I was getting busy with Lego and doing all this, I was staying out of her hair. And now I was back in her hair, always asking her what she's doing, what do we want to do, blah, 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 blah. So she was getting kind of annoyed. So because of that, I ended up saying, you know what, let me get some more motivation back and get back to streaming and get back to making videos so you guys can criticize me all day. One of the first things we did, as you can see, we rearranged the Lego room again. This is gonna be the fourth inner iteration of this room. This room has gone from a display set location to now being going into a city mode where we're gonna be putting in more tables and hopefully getting a city built in this room as best we can with the space that we currently have available. So here's the update on the city. This is where we stand. Everything is going down one big main street only because we want to make sure that we use the amount of space that we have available to us as best as we can. I also got a bunch of roads that I need to build only to fill in some gaps. And I know that I'm going to be going into that second table. So we're going to need a lot more roads. So that's going to be my project for a little while is, is making more mills roads so I can continue um, building down. The other option I'm going to have is creating a two lane. Um, road pretty much two road plates on each side with a median down the middle so we can you know make some landscapings things like that on there to allow us to spread it, spread it out a little bit give it a little bit more wiggle room especially for the vehicles because we do have some six eight and um and four inch vehicles that we got to fit into the city somehow we just finished building the parisian restaurant and that is actually a pretty good build Again, if you guys saw on stream, I had every single bag identified by color and color alone. So I needed to dig through every bag to make sure I knew what piece I was going to be getting. At least the colors helped because it was definitely not the easiest thing in the world. It looks very vintage, very high class. So I put it right next to the Grand Emporium, which, of course, I'm, I, I turned into an FAO Schwartz um, because that's where I met my lovely wife when um back in 1999 so yeah and i'm old so don't remind me uh so we installed um that into into the city we also added birch books we have the mock of the noodle shop in here we all you know the jazz club the diner as you can see we are already uh losing space with just the mod the modulars that we have um we still have some more that we're going to be installing and we have some that we put a poll up on youtube that you guys are allowing us the privilege to telling us what we should get next and it looks like it's going to be either the green grocer or the um, corner cafe which is the two most expensive modulars available so i appreciate that guys so here's your question for all the marbles make sure you answer it in the comments make sure you like the video make sure you subscribe what set did i use to represent where me and my wife met for the first time. I'll leave that up to you. Now it's time for you to go answer that question. Make sure you leave it in the comments below. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And again, we truly appreciate you coming by here and the support you've shown us during this process. 
Much love to every single one of you. Hope you guys have a great day. OBG, out.